Hey there, welcome. Welcome back to the show, to the Ignite Your Purpose podcast, where myself and himself, that guy there, Wade, yeah, anyway, small fry, we talk <laughs> longevity through a healthy lifestyle. It's a mix of the mental, physical, and some spiritual knowledge and experience, and it's, it's our mind, body, soul trifecta. Uh, so we like to talk negative to positive, sharing some of our experiences, uh, some things we've read, and it's just our, it's just our, it's our, it's our spin on things. So today is a little story about about me uh, working in, in in a business with a business, and uh, I was being given uh, an instruction or, or a request to do something, and um, and after the fourth repetition of this request or instruction came out and they began uttering the uh, the fifth i just said noted thank you span on my heels and walked away thinking oh man yeah i understood after the first occasion so i'm not going to waste any more time i'm just being efficient for me uh not five minutes later this said individual taps me on the shoulder and says can i have a minute please just, just for a quick chat and uh, and the fireworks kind of began from their side. And I just said, look, apologies, shouldn't have said that, shouldn't have uh, behaved like that, and uh, I'll, uh, I'll think differently next time. And then there was a, a kind of a, a semi-atmosphere for the rest of the afternoon. And then that evening I said, look, I apologise for earlier. It's never my intention to offend uh, directly or indirectly, so uh, I'll take on board the comments and... And, and that was it. It was all smoothed over. But on that second occasion when we were having this chat, I kind of extracted from my body and was observing this uh, exchange between the two of us. And I kind of went, well done, mate. Pat on the back there. Because, you know, history repeating itself is me kicking off big style and trying to justify my position and explain why I did a certain thing and all, all of that bollocks, but I, I kind of bit my tongue, thought I could argue, I could fucking win this discussion, but actually there would be no winner in it. So uh, that was uh, my uh, my experience today, and I was kind of really, really kind of, uh, really chuffed with that. That's all I've got to say, apart from seeing our T-shirts. These are our oh. T-shirts, negative to positive Ignite your purpose, that's us. That's me and Max. So, um, hopefully, Max, you'll have something to say, otherwise, otherwise this is the shortest show ever. Man, when do I not have something to say, really? Mm, yeah, never. Um, hey, you're wearing a set t-shirt. Hey. That's right. Mine just looks a lot better on me, obviously, as usual. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. The, the, the one thing I will say is I think you obviously handled that situation beautifully. Um, there is... In any situation, we could go so deep. Um, you know, the person that spoke to you, what were their motives? You know, are they are they trying to be dominant? Are they trying to be in a certain position? What was their day like? What's their background? You know, are they finger to the bone and they, you know, they're in command. This is their whole life. They have nothing else. It goes oh so deep. But what you did, beautiful, you know. And in sodas, then we call that the best of two options. What do you want to be in your life? Do you want to be happy? Or do you want to be right? right? So you're going to give up something to get something, right? So I think today you gave up the ego or the, no, I'm right. I get what you're saying. And you simply went, let's roll with this. Let's, it's no skin off either of our backs. This is a mute yeah. point. This yeah. is truly in all honesty, ir irrelevant in the big scheme of things. So my name is John and I'm going to, I'm going to be a gentleman here and I'll take the higher road. And yeah. I'm sure he or she appreciated that. Um, and you know, again, you have a little more self-awareness, I'm sure than most people. So it almost is in your duty to lead by example and teach, you know, by doing, not by preaching. Right. So very poignant. Um, and what else would I like to say? I'm on that one, John. Um, well, I've, I've got someone to chip in. It's, um, okay. it is a, a, sorry, did go you, ahead. No, did you go remember ahead. your point? Yeah, I did. I was just, but yeah. well, I know what it is. Go ahead. So um, I, I used to go, well, I still do go and visit a certain person. Uh, this certain person behaves in, in a certain way every time. 
And uh, again, historically, I've, I'm there within two minutes. I'm rolling my eyes. I'm kind of, yeah, okay, that's really interesting. And it goes. And um, somebody said, or I heard somewhere, if you go into a room or you go into a conversation with somebody and you know what's going to happen because their behavior is so rote, and you react, whether that's you just switch off or you get pissed off. If you react to that behavior that you know is going to happen, <laughs> you're an idiot. Truth. So I, I now go into that those uh, those meetings, and I know exactly what's going to happen. And I say, well, that's okay. I'm expecting this. So I, I use different parts of my brain to, in, to engage in a conversation I would not normally engage in because it's... I've only got so much energy in a day, like so much time. I've got this much time and I've got this much energy and I need to use it really effectively. But on those occasions when we do need to give a shit about other things bigger than ourselves, um, you know, it's just that being self-aware, being aware of it. Um, and I think that only comes with experience. Um, Absolute uh, truth. Yeah. Um, um, and, you know, you know, John, a lot of times with – without people know, and, and this happens to you and me, and so I'm just saying in general, you know, if you're not self-aware and you're just repeating the same program and you're just going through the motions, a lot of time when we're in a conversation or a powerful struggle, we are trying to suck the other person into our drama or our negative energy field yeah, or yeah. whatever, right? So to just simply be aware and, and stand back and be like, excuse me, sir or ma'am or, or wife, husband, Let's just take a breather here and, and really see what's important in this world because this this little talk is irrelevant. Yeah, um, and you know I, I see this a lot. You know, being in the society we live in, uh, anytime there's any type of um, divorce, you know, one side always wants to be right. Yeah, you know what I mean. And it's uh, it's just a power struggle. And it's a power play. Um, and there's so many, you know, you're stomping your hands and I deserve this and it's only fair and it's only this and it should be like that. Um, and at some point, again, you have to give up something to get something, right? So that's right. Kudos to you. And you mentioned, you know, you mentioned you had that uh, second of you remembered how you would react, right? Yeah. So that's a powerful thing. That means you're rerouting your brain. Or, and or I just, even, um, I maybe when I went, I'm just going to put me on the screen. When I said, okay, noted, that was me giving it right. Okay, you're not being effective and efficient now. Let me get on with my job. Um, that is when I clocked, I had behaved in that way and thought, oh, all right, I need to process this. Yeah. Um, and that like enabled maybe. me then to behave in a different way rather than like. to continue with that, that learned behavior that was in, in, in program for so long. There you go. So, so by doing that kind of turning your back, almost giving the, the flip or whatever. You <laughs> That's right exactly there. what I was doing. That's yeah. exactly what I was doing. And, and exactly. I'm guilty of that too. It's like, you know, that ego, that control mechanism, you just want to be like F off. Yeah. But you knew right then and there you had to be bigger and better and you didn't want to continue down that path. So that's, I mean, yeah, that's, all, we can, was, that's um, all we can hope for in our life. I mean, basically it was, yeah, you're boring me now. Shut up. <laughs> um, and you know what? Truthfully, there is a time and a place for that as well because if you know you're going on your fifth, sixth, seventh time, go yeah. around of the same BS. It is a waste of time, your energy, and there are more. Powerful yeah, things and to do. I tell you, Max, we, we've mentioned this before. Is when um, we, we speak about when we become aware of the the energy vampires, or you know, around us and. We spend certain time with certain people and we you can just feel it being drawn away and we've got a mutual friend who will um he'll just put his hand up before this person has even gotten into his space and says <laughs> can't deal with it now don't i don't want to speak to you so uh, which i thought was a big stream but i'm now implementing similar i'm not quite so much i'll put my hand up but i'll i'll cross the street or uh yeah sometimes and then sometimes i will engage because we uh, we do have to be human. Truth, exactly. It's all it's all based on your belief systems, right? So, 
to each their own, I guess, but uh, kudos yeah. for you, brother. And I think that's a good takeaway for people, you know, to, to simply, you know, if, we, if we're talking the soul's purpose, it's never to um, purposely hurt someone, right? Like we don't want to go into any situation doing that. And especially in the workplace, you know what I mean? Like there's no point in having somebody furious with you or upset and like mm -hmm. sad, yep. nothing gets done. You understand energy, you understand energy. That means everybody's energy has gone down. Nothing good's happening for anybody in the workplace or the clients. So just a shitty place to be all around. Yeah. And on that note, I think we'll uh, we'll turn turn the cameras off and go and continue with uh, the stuff that we do uh, on the daily. So uh, from me, JB, thank you very much for tuning in, listening, or watching, or commenting, or reading the content that we produce each and every day. Um, we do appreciate your time. You could be anywhere in the world, but you're right here with us. So we thank you. Max, um, you say the rest of it. And... I am just impressed and excited that everybody's on board with us. We're learning stuff every day, and I appreciate you guys. I appreciate John. And subscribe, like, share, and we will see you tomorrow.